It's the Frank Show. What the Frank Show? Come on, the Frank Show. What the Frank Show? Come on, the Frank Show. What the Frank Show? Come on, the Frank Show. It's time for the show. Pow. Aloha, hey, Ted's Frankie Boy here, and it is time for the Frank Show. Now, today's video is very special to me because around this time last year, there were tons of people thinking and worried the PlayStation VR wasn't going to make it. Now, I definitely was not one of them. I was telling you that 2017 was probably going to be the year that showed whether we were going to, you know, make it or break it. And what I am glad to be here telling you and showing you is that. We made it. Our numbers are reaching over 2 million. We are four times basically most of the competition. Even uh, even the competition's numbers together, uh, we, we still double those. So PlayStation VR is here to stay. The place to game in VR is on PlayStation VR, will be on PlayStation VR for the foreseeable future. So headsets, strap in and get ready for a wicked and wild ride. Now, over the year, a bunch of games came out. I'm talking a bunch of games. And out of all those games, some of them... I shining lights and some of them are giant stinkers and today we are talking about those shining lights because this video is talking about my top 10 favorite PlayStation VR games from 2017 now a lot of you might be thinking you know what number one is but I'm pretty sure you're gonna be pleasantly surprised so definitely check out the whole list and if you haven't grabbed any of the titles on them please enjoy and a big note to everybody hopping into VR for the first time these holiday seasons, or please pay attention to your surroundings when you're playing VR and make sure there is nothing in the way while you're playing. You don't want to get hurt and you don't want to hurt anybody else. Now, on to the video. 2017 is coming to an end. Here are the best games. Here are the best games. Yeah. All right, so number 10 on the list is Star Blood Arena. This is one of my favorite multiplayer games when I can find players online, but don't you fret, the player base is growing day by day. Now, this is a six degrees of freedom Twitch shooter. I mean, you're flying in and out in your spaceship, shooting every which way you use your head to aim. You go up, you go down, you go left, you go right. I mean, you move so fast, you destroy enemies quick. It's a really fun, fast pace game and any player that I've seen get into it and get a solid match going loves it and if you can get a crew going it's really not that hard to find an online match plus with all the updates to matchmaking and all the great features they've continued to add plus cosmetics to unlock there are tons of replayability in this one so I definitely suggest checking it out if you haven't already Number nine on this list is Accounting Plus. Now, a lot of you know this game is that stupid PlayStation VR game where nothing really happens, and it's not really that long. And you know what? To a certain degree, you may be correct there, but I think it really does push the boundaries and show you what's possible for interactions when you go into VR. Because whether you want to agree or not, the way you feel when you're in the scenarios presented to you in Accounting Plus make you a little bit on the uncomfortable side or feel like you're actually there which is something great to see and and uh, a storytelling version of VR with some great gameplay elements and although there is tons of cursing if you can look past that this is a wonderful way to experience something new in virtual reality <laughs> number eight on the list is static now this is one of the most interesting PlayStation VR games I have had the pleasure of playing it, it really sucks you in because you have to hold your DualShock 4 in hand and it really feels like it matches up with what's going on in the world you have to click this and click that and move your trigger here and there and bend your hands left and right and aim around the room to solve puzzles and make your way out it's kind of like an escape the room game but instead of a room you, you're escaping your hands out of a box the story is also pretty fun and pretty cool so if you've not not tried this one out already static truthfully is an amazing game wow! 
Number seven on the list is Spark. Now this is a virtual reality sport at its finest and really the only and first one on PlayStation VR. Grab balls, throw them at your opponent, dodge balls, bounce them off the court and break into a, a hardcore sweat while you're doing it all. Now I love VR because it really does get a lot of people up and moving and a lot of people have started to lose weight while gaming and it's a really great thing for the community. So if you if you've not tried this game out, you're interested in tennis, ping pong, uh, that, that dodgeball, then definitely pick up Spark because it really is something different and new. Number six on my list of PlayStation VR games is Doom VFR. Now, my first couple experiences with this game weren't the greatest things on Earth. It, it took a little while to understand the subtle nuances of the gameplay and get everything right, but once I did, boy, was I having fun. The shooting is phenomenal. The hidden collectibles are great. There's tons of little extras to unlock and challenges to do. You want to go back. You want to move around. The free locomotion makes the game phenomenal. You can also dash here and there. Slowing down time feels great. I mean, I'm a sucker for time mechanics, and I mean, don't forget, it's a Bethesda game, so you know it's pretty polished. Now, there are bugs here and there, but they've worked to fix them, and I'm sure they will do more in the future. So, if you've not tried out Doom VFR, and this is a separate game, has nothing to do with anything else in the series, give it a try. <laughs> Number five on the list of PlayStation VR games is Resident Evil 7. Now, I had never played a Resident Evil game before, I know, I mean, come on, Frankie, but Playing 7 was one of the best experiences I've ever had in my entire life. Now, I'm not a horror game fan, but I definitely am a puzzle and kind of RPG feeling Escape the Room game fan, so I loved Resident Evil 7. It's really cool. It puts you in such a fantastic atmosphere and puts a great story in your hand with convincing enemies that you, I mean, you want to find out more about, you want to have interactions with, which is nothing, I mean, nothing but great game play. I mean, come on. <laughs> Number four on my list is Skyrim VR. Now, I know a lot of you guys just got your PlayStation VR or bought one for this game, and you're loving every moment of it, and rightfully so. It is a fantastic title. It is everything we've come to love about Skyrim put into virtual reality, and although it's not perfect, uh, what Bethesda game is perfect? Whether you're slicing people down, riding dragons, making buddies, making companions, building a house, doing this and that, you can do it all in Skyrim VR, and it is, it, it's just as fun as you think. <laughs> Number three on our list is Farpoint. Now, this is the first person shooter for PlayStation VR, and you definitely need the aim controller. I mean, you can play with the DualShock 4, but you want the aim controller. The, the aim controller is phenomenal, and with the new PvP mode added, plus extra co-op added in, and no charge for any of it, this game is, is just showing that it is one of the best PlayStation VR games all around. The story is top-notch, the multiplayer is phenomenal, and the customization and unlockables are are there for the replayability, please, you gotta check out Farpoint. <laughs> Number two is super hot. I mean, come on, this is probably almost, almost my favorite VR game of, on any system, because uh, I just love it. And like I said, I am a sucker for time manipulation, but nothing beats this gameplay. It's something fresh, it's something new, something we've really never done before, and something we've always wanted to do. Be in the Matrix, stop time, grab bullets, shoot enemies, throw guns, catch them in freeze time, grab the shotgun, steal weapons. I mean, there is non-stop things, story mode, endless plus free DLC on the way and a bunch of extra little hidden goodies here and there hey, this one is a no-brainer for any psvr and ps move owner hey! and finally the top game. Now, a lot of you were saying Resident Evil 7, you already said it. Farpoint, you already said it. Skyrim, you already said it. What is, what is the best PlayStation VR game of 2017? Well, you know what, you guys? That game is 100% free, and it is called Rec Room. Now, Rec Room may be, honestly, the, the, the greatest VR game. There is so much to do. You can build rooms. You can play games. You can shoot 
paintball, you can dodgeball, you can hang out with buddies, you can send messages, you can, uh, I mean, the list goes on and on. You can race RC cars, you can do laser tag, you can go on Quest. I mean, there is, there is thousands of hours worth of content. And what's cool is none of it is scripted. It's just in within a community. And so everything is always going to be completely fresh, completely new, and really completely fun. That is why this one takes the top spot. I'm so glad to see it on PlayStation. PlayStation VR with crossplay between PC users. So the entire Rec Room community gets to hang out as one. And like I said, it's completely free. So what beats that in a game? Honestly, if you get a PlayStation VR and Rec Room is the only game you have, you're set for the entire year. I mean, don't get me wrong, there are grab all of the nine games, but at the end of the day, that's all you really need. So I mean, come on. All right, what'd you guys think? Do you agree with me? Do you have uh, suggestions? Do you have thoughts? Do you have a different list? I would love to know yours, and I'm sure everyone else would love to know it as well. So please let us all know in the comments. And as always, thank you for coming through. Have an amazing holiday season. And if you're new to this channel and you want to stay up to date on everything PlayStation VR, and you don't mind this ugly mug, friggin' subscribe. I mean, come on. Nah. <laughs> All right, smooches, you guys. Merry Christmas Eve, and uh, please have have a great holiday. I got another video coming up soon.